All right, to motivate, empower, and hopefully add it to the local workforce one day. There are a lot of reasons some Detroiters took time away from work today to read to students in Detroit public schools. Our Amir Makepson is on your block at Thurkle Elementary and Middle School in Detroit with a peek inside one of the classrooms for 313 Reads Day. You, dear child, matter making a difference and empowering children. That's the hope of 313 Reads, a program that allows community members to come into the Detroit Public Schools to read motivational books to children. We feel like it's an opportunity to give back. Byron Osborne is a volunteer reader and hopes to not only motivate youth, but also expose them to different career fields. The only way that we can show our appreciation as well as show that there's a viable career as being an electrician is to come to third graders, read to them, tell them about how important it is to read, and give them our story. The student-reader interaction exposes children to professionals in various career fields that look like them, which Principal Stephanie Gaines says is invaluable. When our students see people who look like them achieving great things, they believe they can do it too. It, all, it allows them to focus more. It allows them to, again, achieve and, and dream bigger dreams. And again, not only just for what's happening right now, but we believe here at Thurkle that we are cultivating Detroit's next legends. And so when they see, stu pe when they see people that look like them doing great things, it allows them to know that they can be legendary too. I hope the children learn that electricians do exist, electricians that look like them, that are in their community, and that there is an opportunity for them if they discipline themselves, do good in school, and, and take advantage of every chance that they have in front of them, that they can be successful. The opportunity to become an electrician like Byron may not have resonated so well. I want to be a nail artist and a police officer. I want to be a dancer and an artist. But one thing the students did take away? Always don't give up, follow your dreams. Always follow their dreams through the hard times and the low. In Detroit, Amir Makeupson, CBS News, Detroit.